Okay, we're going to unbox a Voigtlander Perkio 1 camera that I got from uh, Galaxy Camera, uh, the uh, Etsy store. And um, so let's uh, get inside here. Okay, some of the nitty gritty is done. Got uh, invoice and a nice. Um, Ooh, it's 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 hefty. You know, that's a folding it's a folding camera. So, um uh but it's it's like the size of a 35. It's almost like it's like the size of a Leica or something. Um but it's medium format. So, it's just a huge advantage uh negative-wise while being um I mean, it seems like you could put this in your uh in your your coat pocket, your suit uh, pocket. Okay, so here's the back. Here's the front. I figured out getting to the uh, inside. The uh, folded down lens uh, take up spool, which I think it goes the other way actually. So I'm gonna have to switch the spool to this side to then put film through it. Uh, and let's see if I can open up the front. So the front comes up with this uh, button here and then uh, pops into place. And uh, this is really the first time I'm getting a, getting a look at it. So um, uh, focusing. Um, so the downside, no range finder. Um, certainly no through the, through the lens viewing. So your focusing is a bit of a guess, and uh, and you have to meter on your own. Um, but uh, my understanding is that this is from the 50s, maybe uh, 52, 53, uh, 55, somewhere in there. And um, but I was just very intrigued by the the negative uh, size. Um, and I've had other uh, folding cameras like the. Um, GF670, Fuji's a very expensive professional kind of uh, modern version. I mean, just to compare size, I pulled out this is a tiny point and shoot 35 millimeter camera. And then this is our Voigtlander uh, Perkio. And it's so small. And so this is the 6x7 uh, negative size. This is from the other uh, folding camera I had, the um, Fuji GF670. Um, big, uh, big, beautiful uh, negatives, as opposed to um, just like a 35 millimeter uh, negatives being just a, a lot smaller. So I'm very excited to um, run some film through this and uh, see how it comes out. So we are uh, out in the field now with the uh, Perkio, looking at uh, the city of San Francisco, and uh, I've been taking uh, taking a few shots, and uh, we'll see how uh, how it comes out. Hey, I hope you enjoyed that little uh, field trip. Um, I just shot that, um, went out to the marina the day I got the package. Then the next day I developed it in um, the Ilford chemistry uh, here at home in your just kind of stan standard uh, Patterson uh, tanks and things. Um, <clears throat> and uh, scanned it on an Epson V600. Um, this is like the negative. Um, uh, it shoots square, but then I just, um, I always make uh, more rectangular images. Um, you know, this is the camera, and uh, I can just uh, go through, just cock it, it shoots, you wind, um, you do your settings on here, it's very much like a, it's like a view camera lens. I mean, it, 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 it is really a view camera, I mean, it just has bellows, you just can't see to focus it, which is kind of its main 
uh, issue, but uh, but it just gets it so insanely compact. I mean, you know, it's like you know, it's like this. This is a medium format camera that shoots a smaller negative, um, uh, and uh, it shoots a six four five negative. But uh, but it's it's just this monster thing, and um, so. Well, it has its limitations, but it has its charm, and it's just a great little camera. Alrighty, see you next time.